we have to keep our values grounded. As people see one good thing, then they're ready to see more of it. All of us should be able to uh, enjoy the American dream, it's to have a great place to work, great place to live. During the 70s, 80s, and 90s, the neighborhood went down. Honestly, it was a tough community. That's changed. It just needs love and attention and neighbors who really care about the area to promote it. This area is uh, the Wheatley Courts area. People call the projects. So what happened about a year ago, they tore down all the building because they're gonna build a brand new Wheatley Court. Change is finally happening because I think the residents of this area is actually starting to speak up and now their voices is being heard. This park was built in one day. It was 450 people here from different uh, partnerships. It's more of what do you want to see? What kind of neighborhood would you like to live in and raise your children in? Hello, Austin Community Center, how can I help you? We have a lot of services under one, under one roof. Uh, family comes and they want to uh, plug into early child services, they can do that. <laughs> Early Childhood Center. Ready, set, go, go, go! David goes to school. David, recess is over. Tainan is deeply rooted in this community. It has a long history here, and there have been generations of family members that have attended here. They're gonna what? What do we say in our morning mess? Baba, purple. We offer so many family supports, not just educational supports to families, and they feel like they have a home here. This is our parent center. We have all of our outside agencies that are housed here. So this is like a hub of the school for parents and families. Because in order for students to succeed in life, their families need to be strong and know how to support them. Um, there's so many individuals that are walking around that don't even have a GED or a high school diploma. So what I do is I work with the families of the children between the ages of zero and five specifically. So we provide the child care assistance while I'm working with the parents on building a career, um, helping uh, build their education and things like that. That's your GD. <laughs> so if you look at the, the family as a whole, then you wonder how can a parent assist their child with reading or education when they don't have a clue themselves. I'm hoping that I can sit them down and we can develop a career and financial plan, figure out what it is that they want to do, where they want to go, and try to help them, um, you know, step by step with, the, with achieving the goals. Our vision is to um, ensure that uh, families are able to enjoy the quality of life that they, they want to have. Many of the people we, the, in the Neighborhood Association will tell you the reason they moved into the area was because of the people. And if they keep the focus on the people, I think we'll be very successful. So 10 years from now, I hope to see a lot of families with a lot of success stories. I think this will be a, a thriving community. I think it is now. So if we are able to build up the resources with the families and the people that are here in the east side, then our families will be strong enough to sustain themselves over time.